they had this tailing in Dallas. They had passed some kind of rule that you couldn't have long hair. It wasn't safe. So they they opted to not let me fight. Down here in Austin, it don't matter. So sure enough, I went in and signed up, and they, nobody ever said anything adverse. Or said, you know, up here, it was like, whatever. You can fight. Come on, let's go. Well, you have to have strong willpower. You have to do that. I mean, you better have strong willpower. Otherwise, this will break you down. Well, I learned from when I was very young. I started at four years old. This picture here has got me with the trophy I'm holding. And it was just in my blood, so I've just been doing it my whole life. Didn't know any different. Just keeping me young. It's enabling me to be able to still do stuff. I get around, you know, I'm 63 years old now, but I've, I got agility I feel like as good as most of these 20 year olds in here, just because I do this all day, every day. I think that's a lot of people that do this to get chilled out. The majority of people here are white collar, blue collar workers, students. And I have I have a lot of uh, therapists send their patients in here because for whatever reason, all this stuff is very hypnotic. It helps with their mental stability. I've gotten the satisfaction over the years of just seeing lots of people come in here and turn their lives around. Finding out when they get in here, they find a focus and get get zeroed in. And whenever you're boxing, you know, you got to live clean. You want to live clean. Most people are not atoned to, you know, making the effort to do it. I think it really helps people out here building their self-confidence, building their confidence up. And just the fact that uh, people come in here and realize, okay, if I do this, if I practice this, I'm gonna get good at it. And they can make, see themselves making progress. Here. Come on in and join and see what it's like. One more round. 